Hey everybody, this is the chapter 30 review. Um, and this week I want to talk with you about the lathe. The lathe is an amazing um, piece of equipment. It's not like the table saw you can see in the background. It's not like any of the other machines we've used up to this point. It does things completely different. All the other machines, the blade spins and you move the board. On this machine, the board spins and you use a a cutting tool to make the cut. So look what it says. With a wood lathe, the workpiece is shaped by a process called turning. That's what we call it, turning on the lathe. A cutting operation in which the workpiece is revolving against the single edge tool. While the lathe does have many important industrial uses, you'll find you can use it to make a variety of different parts in the shop. Um, so the Nearpod activity, I have a video about just some basic information about the lathe your video research project, you have to find something on uh, YouTube that's being made on the lathe. Here's a picture of the lathe, um, just all the different parts of it, headstock, faceplate, tool rest, tailstock, tailstock spindle, um, the base, the bed, the switch, the outboard bed, speed control, just a few of the different parts. Um, this section is on the different tools that are used. This is important because in the video research um, project, you have to name one of the tools that they're using. So there's a gouge, a skew, a round nose, spear point, and parting tool. Um, methods of turning, there are two methods of turning. One is known as cutting and the other is scraping. In cutting, the tool actually digs into the revolving piece, creating shavings of wood, whereas scraping, it's held at a right angle. Instead of peeling away thin shavings, it just scrapes away fine particles. So Scraping is what we usually use in shop. Cutting is a little more complicated of a method. Safety first, lots of safety. You have to read it. It's not just eye protection now. It's a lathe shield. Um, it talks about where the tail stuck should be and play, things like that. Check that out, the safety first. Um, there's two different methods of turning. There's what's called spindle turning and then also face plate turning. This is setting up for spindle turning. Check it out on the video. Um, it gives you some speeds, shows you about, a little bit about spindle turning, a little bit about finish turning on spindle turning. You have to read all this. I don't have, I only have five minutes in my, uh, in my video I can uh, record. Um, you have to look through that about shoulder cutting. They give you a good example of it. And lastly, they get into cutting tapers and V's and beads. And then now we get into faceplate cutting. Here we go. And so the other method of cutting is what's known as face plate or the other method of turning is called face plate turning and that is where we attach things to a face plate and then turn um, sometimes on the outboard bed like bowls and cups and vases and things like that there you go face plate turning bowls and then the last area is your seven questions if you have any questions about the lathe i'd love to talk with you about it talk to you soon